Good morning, good morning, good morning, you guys. Welcome to my channel. I am Nick. I am in Patty. This is my day three. And I didn't give y'all the outfit of the day, which is crazy as hell. But I was trying to get out. So I'll do the outfit of the day. This is my dress. Ah, it's from Fashion Nova. My glasses are Chanel, earrings, Chanel, my purse, YSL. I got on tennis shoes, y'all, because we've been walking. Here is the Eiffel Tower. There you go. Today is another day that we're being very spontaneous. We're gonna do a couple of photo shoots here by the Eiffel Tower, and then it's my husband's birthday, and we're going to just wing it. And I'm gonna show you in a second, as soon as I can find a place to set my phone, what my outfit looked like. Ever come to Paris, right across the street is this little park, and like, um, I don't know if, I don't know what they call it like a platform or something and um, you can get like really good photos and it's right across there at that park you gotta cross the Ferris wheel on the other side of the street and you get like this perfect view of the Eiffel Tower in your photos bridge right there that's where the bridge we was at last night Alright, so this is the area that I was telling you about. They get married over there. Isn't that adorable? But this is that area and that's the name of it. Okay. And then Joseph's. And then look, that's your view. Right? So perfect. Thank me later. Everybody, just come early in the morning. You see how many people is here. If you come later, you're gonna have a lot of people to be, you know, fight over a perfect spot. But anywhere here is a perfect spot for your photos. Just a little tip, y'all. Just a little tip. Oh, that look at. If you, too bad you can't see what I see, but it's like a straight shot through the park. It's so beautiful. Okay, y'all, we think it's, well, it is starting to rain. Not I think, it's a light drizzle right now. We're trying to get to this mall before it starts pouring down. We wasn't prepared for rain. We didn't bring an umbrella or jackets or nothing like that. We just knew that everywhere we went to it was gonna be like at least 100 degrees. So, <sighs> y'all. But at least it's not pouring down. Nothing doesn't stop a vacation, y'all. Not even rain. We're on our way to the Plain Flamingo for Joseph's birthday. We're going to dinner. I can't wait. We're so excited. This is our fit for the day.
medios. Sorty exit. to ourselves uh, I can't even tell you what time is it? it's 8 o'clock in the morning on a Friday we have it to ourselves look there's no one in the streets to take those pictures I don't even know what to do with myself I finally made it here I've been here three times this is my first time actually making it here I'm so excited I don't know what to do with myself I think I'm just going like 
do the street photo or what should I do? We'll see, we'll see. Okay, you guys, we made it. We took some photos, not a lot, but we did take some really good photos. I'm happy with those. And then now we're gonna go check it out and see what it's all about, other than its exterior beauty. Yeah, you can. Always helping somebody else. Probably the answer. Eh? Okay, well, we made it all the way across town from the towers, and now we're going to see Notre Dame. My husband hasn't seen it. I've been inside it before the fire happened, so it'd be interesting to see if we are able to go inside or just look from the outside and how different it looks from the original when I see it. Yeah. Everything getting started. <laughs> made it to Notre Dame it is so different within the last of course like four years since we've been here all this front side was not here the last time we were here you can't even come in this area we actually literally across the I think the river there's a restaurant we looked at it from there but they're still reconstructing it 
so crazy, but they're trying to restore it back to its original glory. We came back just in time. It's starting to rain. And we have decided to have our picnic in our hotel. And we got a bunch of goodies. We on our way to Italy. I'm so excited. <laughs> Baby, Leg two so of our trip. Leg two. Leaving Paris on our way to Rome. It, Rome. Okay, you guys, we made it to Rome. We're so excited. We have to pick up our luggage and drop that luggage off at a storage place. And then from there, we need to figure out about um, our tours and stuff. So, super excited. About to figure out, I saw the luggage come off the airplane, so it's just all about um, where to go from here. Is that supposed to be like Alexander the Great or something? Well, I guess that is where he will stand out on the balcony, you know what I'm saying? Where? Up there, in the middle. We got our hat. I know, it's like, it's really hot. 
We are in Rome. We just, um, I think the last thing you saw it was we were at the Vatican. Now we're at one of the biggest, largest church dedicated to um, the Virgin Mother. But we're at an actual restaurant right across the way. Delicious. It's called Restaurante Casa Maria. I said that. But I wanted to show y'all some. Now, I've been traveling for a lot, a long time, and this is what my 26th country because Rome, Italy is my 25th country, and the Vatican is a small country, and that made my 26th. But I always carry hot sauce, y'all, because I ain't got hot sauce everywhere, and I don't play. I need my hot sauce, y'all. Headphones, throw on some music. We gotta charge our phones. How, how far back do these roads go? That's the true question. You know? Terriers probably rolled on these roads. They let people inside. The reason why it's just crumbling is because they let people inside.